you were down at Basel Hospital last night with Lorna. What happened and how did it go? Yeah, we asked to uh, make a visit last night. It was announced, so they knew it was coming. Um, but we had their cooperation, which was absolutely fantastic. We made a visit to a &E. Obviously, that was the main area of concern from the um, monitor report. And we also went to maternity. They had a report this week um, mentioning some points that they were uh, concerned over. It was, it was very good. We were allowed to go where we wanted. We were allowed to speak to patients. Um, and they were quite relaxed in giving us their opinions, which they were quite mixed. Um, we will be making further visits uh, with links as well and more scrutiny meetings. Um, so hopefully it should be the start of a good process to work together with the hospital and see improvements to the residents. Some people might say, a bit like the Queen, did you smell fresh paint everywhere <laughs> you went? <laughs> there was areas under construction because they've got a, a multi-million pound uh, revamp of their A&E department, merging that with their children's outpatient, uh, children's A&E and um, the minors and majors area. So there was fresh paint, but I don't <laughs> for one minute think it was on my account. Um, but it's good to see there's work in progress and improvements being made. Um, we did highlight some concerns we had and they was willing to take those on board and work, work to improve those. Um, so I look forward to our next visit down there really and see if things have moved forward. There was a story last a couple of weeks ago at the Health Committee it's, and with Alan Whittle etc there. It's not a witch hunt though is it? We want to work with the hospital to make improvements really for the residents of the borough to, to restore their confidence to be able to go to the hospital. I mean the PCT have said people are going to other hospitals because they haven't got the confidence in Basildon. We desperately need to work with the hospital and the PC to improve that confidence for the residents in the borough that can't make those choices and go elsewhere. At that meeting again you weren't particularly happy with their, with their argument regarding not showing you the Price Waterhouse Cooper report? Uh, we have asked for that document and we did make it clear that it'd be better for them to give that to us rather than asking the Price Waterhouse Coopers their self and going through that route. Um, so once that report's published, I'm sure we will get that report and hopefully it'll say all the things we wanted to say. And did you feel in the committee meeting that you had a wholehearted support on this issue from Labour? Absolutely. So, you know, the, the task and finish group we've set up is a, is a cross-party working group. There's independence, Labour and obviously Conservative. So it, it's a cross-party issue. Every resident in the borough needs to be assured that we're doing something as a council to drive forward the change that Monitor has put forward in the action plan. 